I, Robin Mouton. I, Robin Mouton. Do solemnly swear and affirm. Do so solemnly swear and affirm. That I will faithfully execute. That I will faithfully execute. The duties of the office of mayor. The duties of the office of mayor. There you have it, a historic day at Beaumont City Hall. Robin Mouton becoming the city's first black female mayor. The lifelong Beaumont resident previously served on city council representing Ward 4. She also served as mayor pro tem from 2016 to 2017. Good evening, everybody. I'm Jordan Williams. Dejanique has the night off. Former Mayor Becky Ames said goodbye today after 14 years, and Mayor Mouton took her seat front and center. 12 News reporter Cameron Seibert was there for this transfer of power. He's here tonight with more. Thanks, Jordan. It surely was a momentous day in the council chambers at City Hall as Beaumont has a new leader for the first time in 14 years. A day for the history books. Former councilwoman Robin Mouton was sworn in as the 42nd and first black female mayor. I, Robin Mouton, do solemnly swear and affirm. Do so solemnly swear and affirm. A feat that resonates beyond the walls of City Hall. I have four beautiful daughters, and for my daughters to see that someone that looks like them can actually get to a prestigious title like this, it speaks volumes. It speaks volumes to a lot of folks who came for the swearing-in ceremony. A <laughs> big crowd of people down there to welcome our new mayor. Inside the chambers, it was standing room only as Mayor Mouton thanked her supporters before she took the center seat. I'm deeply honored to, re to represent the city as your 42nd mayor. And although tough decisions lie ahead, council members believe Mouton is poised to do well for the city. I believe that she has a vision to address the issues that we're facing right now in public works and infrastructure. But beyond that, I believe that uh, Mayor Mouton has a real vision to move Beaumont forward. A lifelong resident of Beaumont, Mouton believes she knows what the people want from their mayor. And that I be an example of what anyone would want to see in a mayor and uh, the integrity and the pride of Beaumont because I love Beaumont and I want to represent the citizens of Beaumont. No denying it's a day that will go down in Beaumont's history forever, but as any city official knows, time for celebrations are always limited. They got right down to business afterwards. Cameron Seibert, 12 News. All right, Cameron.